Hello and welcome from a stadium that really does catch the eye, the Metropolitano here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Atletico Madrid and they take on Real Valladolid. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Always my favourite time of the week, spending time with you at games. We should be in for a belter here with these two. This is the starting lineup for Atletico. Jan Oblak starts in goal. Jose Maria Jimenez plays with Stefan Savic in central defence. Thomas Parze starts alongside Saul in central midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. The starting 11 for Real Valladolid. It does look as though they will mirror their opponents with a conventional 4-4-2 formation, Lee. Yeah, and when you go against a 4-4-2 and you're playing it yourself, you match up in midfield, that's the important area. Sometimes when you play two midfield players, you can get outnumbered when a number 10 comes in between you, but it's not the case today. It's all about individuals against individuals. Who's going to come out on top? Now they get the ball rolling. Joao Felix. Thomas. Morata. He's got to score. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, let's see that strike again. First time is always very, very difficult to strike a ball. The timing has to be right, the technique has to be right, but above all, you have to concentrate on the ball as it's coming to you. You know you're not going to take a touch. Concentration is everything. Well, the manager knows the importance of that goal. He also knows that you're at your most vulnerable just after you've scored. So back underway with Atletico in charge. Oh goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Excellent ball over the top. It has to be! Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Plano. Real danger. A chance to whip it in. Renan Lodi. Saul. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Well, that shouldn't really happen from a throw in. It is to be a throw in. Trippier now. Savage. Trippier. Thomas now. Now Correa. Morata. Ruben Alcaraz. Oscar Plano. Now let's see about the cross. Saul. 
So a throw in here. Tony Villa. Teammates in the middle. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. After his challenge, Kieran Trippier goes into the referee's notebook. Well, as a fullback, when you get booked, you're always a little bit anxious about your next challenge. Well, the manager's not happy, is he? Can't blame him, really. in there on the ball Morata Saul well they've lost possession of the ball it's got to be well, the shot from that position left a bit to be desired you've just got to hit the target let the power down a little bit and go for accuracy Saul on the ball Morata Thomas now Saul and can he take the chance what an important piece of defending it did take a touch on the way through hence a corner Short corner it is. Joao Felix giving it a try. Absolutely magnificent goalkeeping. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. So the corner played into the box. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Saul Jimenez. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Partey getting forward. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. But he took care of it defensively. Koke, space and time for the cross it's opening up for them rob them Saul Joao Felix Saul the keeper was never likely to be in trouble then Ordinary first touch, but keeps the ball nonetheless. Far from a good pass. Atletico really dominated possession the last 15 minutes especially. The creativity has been relentless. Their forwards are on fire as well. The chances are there. Can they extend their lead? On the ball, Morata. Joao Felix. Can he take advantage? Nice and easy for the keeper. A lot of momentum to this Atletico attack. 
Javi Moyano. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Has a go. And the keeper taking care of the situation. The first half here comes to an end. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Now, will they do it from here? And so, it will be a corner. <laughs> and over comes the corner. Tremendous block. Oh! off the post well cleared away Thomas Correa fine sequence of passes moving the ball effectively losing possession a bit easily Unal well they've lost possession of the ball Correa Koke with it well, certainly making attacking inroads Atletico Madrid but what can they do from this position and they'll have to throw it back in play and well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game Promising sequence. Good control under pressure. They've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Enes Unal with it. Javi Moyano. Tremendously strong in the tackle. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Trippier. Correa. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Comfortable on the ball, moving it forward here, Atletico. Fede on the ball. Tony Villa. Nacho. And the cross goes in. And the cross not quite accurate enough. And teammates to play it to. Not really the ideal clearance. Uh, completely misfired with that one. A long way off target. Yeah, but it goes in the top corner and your hero is worth an effort. It's with Saul. Koke with it. Keeping the ball moving. Options in the centre. Has plenty of know-how in the ball shielding department. Speculative ball fired to the near post. Gets his glove on it. Partey. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. An important interception. Crisp tackling. Straight down the throat of the opposition. Won it back. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Fede on the ball. Poor attempt at a pass, really.
Fede. It might be on for them. Tony Villa. Nacho. And there's the feed into the box. Trippier. Morata. Koke. And in the second half, the signs are positive. They can't relax, Lee, but they ought to be pleased. With a narrow lead and the clock ticking, it's so easy for the athletic players to lose concentration. Asking the referee how long to go. Look at fine reaction from the keeper. Yeah, it looked like a good opportunity, to be fair. But the keeper was more than equal to it. Fired over the corner and space for the cross. Well, the header didn't exactly go to plan. Well, I'm not sure what he did there when he caught it on the top of his head, but whatever he did, it was a poor attempt. Jimenez Marcos Llorente well high marks for that pass read it magnificently and intercepted Enes Unal with it tremendous intuition to win it back the electronic board has been held aloft two additional minutes here well, it must be mighty annoying when you can't get near the ball. Well, couldn't keep it. And the referee blows for full time. I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. He's always a man to watch for the opposition, but they couldn't keep tabs on him in that vital moment when he grabbed that goal.